More, uh, more control. Good. Keep that shoulder down. What is going on crack addicts? Welcome back to the channel. Now in today's video, I'm gonna be posting a wide variety of chiropractic adjustments from some of your favorite chiropractors, some of the most loved ones and most well-known on YouTube. So that's what you're gonna be seeing in today's video with some new additions also. All of their links will be in the description. That's where you can check them out directly. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button to the channel and make sure you turn on post notifications so you don't miss any content from the channel. Now let's get into it and I'll see you on the next one. Next up, we have Dr. Alex Tubio. Like, okay. like my posture is like this or something. So like when I do push-ups, you'll see it more prominently where one pushes up more than the other. Is there any pain when you do that? Just stretching. Okay, good. Go face down now. Okay, I want to do this. I want you to keep this leg straight okay. and then lift the leg off off the table. The left leg? Yep, the left one. Good. Do the other side. Ooh. Which side's harder? The right side. The right side? It seemed like the right side was harder. So we're gonna adjust in here first, okay? Getting right into this lower junction here. So take a deep breath in and exhale out. Good, let your shoulders relax. That's perfect. Good. Ow. <laughs> so hold right here. Okay, we're gonna be doing this side. Kind of like we do with him. You alright? Yeah. You sure? Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna push right here. I'm scared. <laughs> You ready? Yeah. All right, so take a deep breath in and let your air out. Good, let your shoulders roll over more. That's it. So don't, don't. <laughs> it's already, it's already moving. <laughs> no. All right, close your eyes. Good. Oh my God. <laughs> That's good right there. Um, so keep this bottom like straight. Yeah. <laughs> this, is this is the hip thing. Yeah. This good is the hip thing. <laughs> and then uh, you're gonna interlock your fingers like this first. There you go. And let your head relax down. Yes. So we gotta see how much flexibility you have, which is a lot. Down. That's it. Good. You all right? So we gotta open this up a little bit more. Good. No, no, no. I'm gonna open it up. Oh. Yep. I just have to let that hang down. That's good. So I want you to take a deep breath in. Exhale out. Good, relax your stomach a little bit more. And then close your eyes there, here. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I love that one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna pull. That's it. You're gonna let your leg hang off. Just like that again. Good. So look at Keep your eyes closed. <laughs> Gonna turn your head. There you go. Try relax this trap. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I knew it was coming every time you told me to close my eyes. I'm like. Control. Grab your head. Good. Let this. Dry. Give me more. That's more control. Well, I mean, like, just give me more, uh, more control. Good. Keep that shoulder down. Now I know. <laughs> <laughs> so just yeah. give me full control. <laughs> Wait to the right. It's better. How does that feel? Good. Good. Lay on your back now. And let's go all the way down. Take my uh, legs off? Yep. <gasps> oh no, not this one. This is a scary one. <laughs> no, this is a great one. <laughs> 
<laughs> Good. Let your neck go a little bit more. That's it. You know, try to picture your chest expanding and your neck expanding a little bit. And then when you can do that, you feel like you're relaxing. <laughs> Whoa. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> 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 you should. I want right. to touch my 360. Good, this feel a lot looser. Do you feel that? Yeah. Good, look all the way to the left. Good, look all the way to the right. That's better. So mm -hmm. you can pull your chin out a little bit more there. Am I an owl yet? Yeah. Up next, we have Dr. Doug Willem. Exactly. The muscles rolling under my finger or vice versa. So I'm going to adjust that first, okay? So I'm going to laterally flex a little bit and you're going to hear a little pop, I think, okay? Big breath in and blow it out. Mm. You heard it, right? Yeah. Right in there's another one. So I'm just squeezing the muscle just to warm it up a little bit. Mm. That was the big that one. That was a good one. That was the, yeah. that was the big one. <laughs> Here's one in the middle. Big breath in and blow it out. And you felt it. Yeah. We might not have heard it so much, but you felt like a pop there, didn't you? Yep, absolutely. So head back to center. I'm going to come up a little higher here, Mike, right into T3. Okay. Line your back next. There might be if I change the angle. I still think there's some tightness at T3, and before I quit on it, instead of hitting the same way that's not working over and over, I like to change my game plan. So this time I'm putting them supine. I don't know them yet. I've never worked with them before. So I haven't like memorized all the best ways to move something on you. But sometimes if someone doesn't adjust great face down, the same spot might go effortless face up. So we're going to yeah, try it. Sounds great. Let's give it a shot. Yeah. yeah. It went. There it was. Yeah. And much easier. Absolutely. Yeah. Least resistance, right? Yeah. There you go. Plus there's less chance of me hurting him. If I just keep slamming an area that's saying no to me, um, back off. Try something different. Just pulling on those. Mm -hmm. Let's go back to the thoracics, but I'm going to drop down to uh, the kind of where the lats tie in. Right down here. <clears throat> and that went yep, nice. Yeah. Did that feel good? It did, yeah, that felt great. Good. I mean, your lats are in a lot of your movements. They're going to yeah, be, in your, for sure. be in your snatch, um, any of your pulls, you know. Yeah, I definitely felt that. Yeah. That was a good one. So, um, lie on your side facing this way, please. Post your chain, right? Yeah. Got to keep yeah, that yeah. fresh. So now we're going to just do a little on the lower back. See if it wants to open up a little bit. One more. <sighs> Got it finally. Yeah, I you did feel, feel it? one. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I felt that one. No, in my heart, there's something in there. Right. And there was a little bit at L4 that I want to get rid of because I think Definitely. that might be a spot that you notice tightness if you do a lot of. Um, you know, heavy deadlift day, um, you know, squats all the way deep. Sure, sure. No, turn this way. Yep. In CrossFit, you do, you, you pass parallel on your squats, ass to the grass. That's right. Right. That's the rule. And what, what I mean for people watching, if you just do squat where you're just doing these little half things, it will, really doesn't put that much challenge on your range of motion. But if you go all the way deep where you're low, low, low and coming out of the hole, it's, it's definitely a much different exercise. All right, lie on your back next. So. Okay. Sometimes it's a 
some muscle and bone. Sometimes it's just yeah. wear and tear. <laughs> you know, a lot of repetitions. For sure. No, they're okay. You didn't you didn't miss the line bones in the wrist. If you made it to the end of the video, guys and girls, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more.